good morning students welcome to 6th standard social revision class students today we are going to revise the lesson in history unit 1 vedic culture in north india and megalithic culture in south india choose the correct answer first question aryans first settled in dash regions there are four options are given here in that four options option a punjab is the correct answer so aryans first settled in punjab region okay second one aryans came from dash there are four options are given among this option c is the correct answer so aryans came from central asia next third one our national motto satyameve jayade is taken from dash there are four options are given among this option d is the correct answer what is the option d children upanishad so our national motto satyameve jayade is taken from upanishad okay next one fourth question what was the ratio of land revenue collected during vedic age 1 by 3 1 by 6 1 by 8 1 by 9 or different options so among this option b is the correct answer 1 by 6 so what was the ratio of land revenue collected during vedic age is 1 by 6 is the correct answer next one roman letter 2 match the statement with the reason tick the appropriate answer okay first we have to read the assertion assertion the vedic age is evidenced by good number of text and adequate amount of material evidences this is the statement next for this statement there is a reason shrutis comprise the vedas the brahmanas the aryan yakas and the upanishad so for the statement that is for the assertion there is a reason so we have to find out the answer so there are four options are given now here option d is the correct answer what is the option d children a is false but r is true so what is a a is assertion r is reason here a is false this in the assertion is false the vedic age is evidenced by good number of text and adequate amount of material evidences and for but or reason shrutis comprise the vedas the brahmanas the aryan yakas and the upanishad so a is false but or is true okay so option d is the correct answer next one children statement 1 and statement So there are two statements given. We have to find out the correct answer. Statement one: Periplus mentions. Periplus mentions the steel imported into Rome from Peninsular India was subjected to duty in the port of Alexandria. Statement two: Evidences for iron smelting. has come to light at payampalli so there are two statements are given here there are four state four answers are given now we have to find out which is correct answer so option c option c both the statements are correct both the statements are correct so statement 1 and statement 2 is also correct so option c is the correct okay children next one third question which of the statement is not correct in the vedic society so 
in the vedic society some of the rules they followed so one statement is wrong well, we have to find out which is the wrong statement for vedic society first we read out option a a widow could remarry option b child marriage was in practice option c father's property was inherited by his son option d sadi was unknown so there are four options given here which of the statement is not correct so is not correct means they are not followed they are not followed in vedic society we have to find out which uh, which is the statement children option b what is the option b child marriage was in practice so this statement or this rules they are not followed okay so option b is the correct answer next one fourth one which is the correct ascending order of the rig vedic society option a grama kula vis rashtra jana option b kula grama vis jana rashtra option c rashtra jana grama kula vis option d jana grama kula vis rashtra so they arrange the ascending order okay they arranged the ascending order now we have to find out which is the correct order so which is the correct ascending order of the rig vedic society which is children so option b option b is the correct answer so what is the order first kula next grama next vis next jana last one rashtra so option b is the correct answer for this question okay next one roman letter 3 fill in the blanks vedic culture was dash in nature kinship in nature second one dash was a tax collected from the people in vedic period answer is bali b a l i bali next third one dash system is an asian learning method option um, correct answer is gurukula so gurukula system is an asian learning method fourth one adichanallur is in dash district thootukudi district okay next one true or false there are five statements given we have to form, write which statement is true which statement is false first one the roman artifacts found at various sites provide the evidence of indo roman trade relations so we have to find out this statement is true second one a hero stone is a memorial memorial stone raised in remembrance of the honorable death of a hero so this statement is also true next one the army chief was called gramani this statement is false fourth one the black and red were pottery became the characteristics of the megalithic period so this statement is also true next fifth one evidence for iron smelting has come to light at payamballi so this statement is also true so for this lesson all the four statements are true except one so which one third one the army chief was called gramani so that is the false statement okay next one match the following we have to read out first site next finds um, kiredi porundal kodumanal adichinallur opposite site ivory dice tip of plugs spindles gold ornaments so for um, which uh, question which answer we have to find out so there are four options are given among this option d is the correct answer option d is the correct answer what is the option d children 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 now we have to read what is one kiredi for kiredi ivory dice is the correct answer porundal for porundal tip of plugs is the correct answer uh, 
கொடுமனால் ஃபார் கொடுமனால் ஸ்பிண்டில்ஸ் ஆல்சோ கரெக்ட் ஆன்சர் ஆதிச்சநல்லூர் கோல்டு ஆர்னமெண்ட்ஸ் இஸ் கரெக்ட் ஆன்சர் ஓகே ஸோ ஆப்ஷன் டி இஸ் த கரெக்ட் ஆன்சர் ஓகே சில்ட்ரன் நெக்ஸ்ட் வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு ரீட் ஆன்சர் இன் ஒன் ஆர் டூ சென்டென்சஸ் ஒன் ஆர் டூ சென்டென்சஸ் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் கொஸ்டின் நேம் த ஃபோர் வேதாஸ் நேம் த ஃபோர் வேதாஸ் த ஃபோர் வேதாஸ் ஆர் ரிக் யஜூர் சாமா அண்ட் அதர்வா ஓகே செகண்ட் ஒன் வாட் வேர் த அனிமல்ஸ் டொமஸ்டிகேட்டட் பை வேடிக் பீப்புள் வேடிக் பீப்புள் வாட் ஆர் ஆல் த அனிமல்ஸ் தே கெப்ட் அட் ஹோம் ஸோ வாட் ஆர் த ஹாசஸ் கவுஸ் கோட்ஸ் ஷீப் ஆக்சன் அண்ட் டாக்ஸ் வேர் டொமஸ்டிகேட்டட் இன் த லேட்டர் வேடிக் பீரியட் த ஆரியன்ஸ் டேம்ட் எலிஃபென்ட்ஸ் ஆல்சோ ஓகே நெக்ஸ்ட் தேர்ட் கொஸ்டின் வாட் டூ யூ நோ அபவுட் மெகாலித் ஆல்ரெடி ஐ டோல்டு இன் த கிளாஸ் டைம் so meha means big so the term megalith is derived from greek mehas means great and lithos means stone so using big stone slabs built upon the places of burial is known as megalith fourth question what are dolmens dolmens are megalithic tombs made of two or more upright stones with a single stone lying across the burial site fifth one what are urns urns are large pottery jars used for burying the dead sixth one name the coins used for business transactions in vedic period nishka satmana that is gold coins and krishnala silver coins were used to for business transactions next seventh question name some megalithic monuments found in tamil nadu there are two megalithic monuments one is dolmens another one is menhir dolmens are megalithic tombs megalithic tombs dolmens have been found in veera raghavapuram village in kanjipuram district Kumala Marudupatti in Dindukal district and in Narasingha Patti in Madurai district. Okay. Next one children, normal letter 7. Answer the following. Write briefly about the archaeological site at Kodumanal. There are 5 points are given. We have to read 1 by 1. First point. Kodumanal is located in Erode district. Second point, more than 300 pottery inscriptions in Tamil, Brahmi have been discovered there. Third point, archaeologists have also discovered spindle. Olds used for making thread from cotton. Fourth one, pieces of cloth along with tools weapons ornaments beads particularly carnelian also discovered here fifth one a menhir found at burial site is assigned to the megalithic period next second question children write about the vedic women in a paragraph this question is a very important okay there are eight points are given we have to read one by one in rigvedic society women relatively enjoyed some freedom second point the wife was respected as a mistress of the household third point she could perform rituals in her house fourth point in rigvedic period widows could remarry fifth point but they were denied to inherit inherit parental property sixth point they played no role in public affairs seventh one in the later vedic period women's position declined demanded to perform rituals 
and marriage rules became more rigid 8 point polygamy became common and women were denied education okay children so this lesson we revised thoroughly study well children get ready for second midterm test okay thank you children